Welcome back. <laughs> the new Sports Illustrated Swimsuit Edition is out. We have uh, the first copy, actually. Wow. <laughs> Kate the Upton. first copy. Where's the swimsuit? Kate Upton. <laughs> Kate Upton happens to be on the cover, but inside there are even more gorgeous models, like our next guest. I love them, and you know what? If they weren't so nice, I'd be very, very upset, but they're very nice. Uh, joining us from the issue are Jessica Perez, uh, who's making her second appearance here on Good Day New York. Yes, nice to have you back you. here. Thanks and Emily D. Donato, a swimsuit issue. You rookie. Yep. Nice to have a rookie here on Good Day New York as well. Mm -hmm. Congratulations, Thank first of all. Thank you very much. All right. Where did you guys go for these pictures? It's seven continents is the theme. You went ever Where'd you go? I went to Africa. I was in Namibia. Wow. Yeah, long flight. And Jessica, where did you go? I went to Easter Island off the coast of Chile. My goodness gracious. Yeah. With those big statues? Yes, with the Moya statues. Oh, that's exactly. so cool. So cool. So, all right. Emily, yeah. you're from this area, right? Yep. Upstate New York? Upstate New York. Near Newburgh. Yeah, new, near, yes, near so Newburgh. So what do mom and dad think about you being in the swimsuit issue? They're super excited, super duper excited. My dad's a huge sports fan, and he's a retired firefighter, like, totally excited. My mom, too. They're super pumped. Well, that's interesting. You say huge sports fan. Sports. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> Jessica, what is the tie-in? And look, I think it's delightful. Everybody loves this magazine. But uh, what is the tie-in <laughs> girls in bikinis and sports? Well, I think that, um, well, the Super Bowl just ended, so people are a little bit depressed about that, so then we need to cheer them up with girls in bikinis. There you go. So there is no sports tie, yeah. <laughs> except that it's my uh, tie. Gotcha. The Super Bowl was two weeks ago. Gotcha. <laughs> All right. For, for those of us who've got maybe a few inches more than we should on our body, tell us what you do to kind of get into shape and to really look good for these issues. Me? Spinning fanatic. Really? Soul cycle all day, every day. You're kidding. Which which Obsessed. which one do you go to? Union Square. How That's come I never <laughs> see you there? And why don't I look I like think her? I might I have seen you there. Too. I go all the time. It's the best thing. I'm like a walking so advertisement. Much fun, right? The best. Yeah, that's me. That's what I do always. But. And what about you, Jessica? Um, well, I do. Um, I have personal trainers. I have three of them, and with one of them, Justin Gelband, I'll do, um, you know, like toning. And then with Joe Hernandez, I'll do Muay Thai boxing. And then with Lynn Duffy, I'll do more like Pilates, like stretching. And then I, on my days off, I'll do yoga for a good stretch. All right. Well, it's but. working. <laughs> <laughs> Jessica, how'd you get into the business? Oh, Emily. Oh, Jessica, oh. pardon me, Emily, Jessica. Yes. Um, about like four years ago, a family friend recommended I go see an agency, and I went to see them, and I literally went on castings that day, and that was it, and then I just started. I That's 17. it? Stop yeah. it. How I just, you, wow, Jessica. Jessica. Did you struggle a little bit, Emily? Uh, uh, no, I'm not going to lie, not <laughs> really. I, I literally started going out on casting and started working. I was in 11th grade. It was just like... Okay, Jessica, how about you? Where did you grow up, and, and how did you get in? Well, I grew up in Latin America, but I was living in New York, and I was in Soho shopping, and an agent from Trump Model Management spotted me on the street and told me I should go in and talk to them, and next thing I knew, I was signed with them, and that's how I started, too. It was also rather quick, mm -hmm. like, quick like you. Yeah. yeah. So what, what kind of doors open after being in the Sports Illustrated uh, magazine? I mean, it's my first time. You let me know. <laughs> right, so let me tell you. <laughs> yeah. First of all, I bet you get cute guys after this, right? I mean, yeah, flocking before it was an issue. Okay. No. Um, well, I, you know, I've been able to do like a uh, get into more like acting. I'm trying to, you know, launch my acting career now, and I've gotten some opportunities. I think because SI put me on the map. And also, you just become more recognizable to clients. So, you know, you are able to brand your name um, for different clients and you get a higher rate for your job. Yeah. <laughs> more money. Good. More, more the exposure cash. in general is just a good thing. It's yeah. a good thing. Yeah. But what about post modeling? Po uh, you'd like to be an actor. Uh, how about you, Emily? Like, what, what comes next? You can't <sighs> to do this be forever. Honest, I have no idea. I'm literally considering becoming a spinning instructor. I'm so upset. <laughs> I've never had any idea, but I think something in fitness or health or something like that, because it's really something I'm passionate about. Wow. Well, congratulations to you both. You can Thank see them uh, both in the Swimsuit 2013 edition with Kate Upton. Are you guys, is there any rivalry with Kate Upton? Any? No, no way. I think she's great. Go, girlfriend. I think she deserves she's great. It. Yeah. Yeah. Will you have a pizza with me later? Absolutely. Well, you gave me Snickers last time, and now you have nothing. Where's I'm my sorry. food? <laughs> we promised to have something next time. Anyway, congratulations to both of you. Thank you, Jessica and Emily. Yeah, Good luck. Thanks. Thank you. Nice.